Well, hello, this is Renee Michelle Floyd coming to you again with tip number two on how to combat dryness in your scalp and hair. And so tip number two is talking about ACV, which is apple cider vinegar. And this is the brand that I normally use right here, Bragg's um, apple cider vinegar, the organic raw unfiltered. And the reason that I use that is because it has the mother in it, which is actually the pulp of the uh, the apple. As you can probably see, it's pretty cloudy um, down there. But this is the brand that I use, the Bragg's um, Organic Apple Cider Vinegar. And for short, we call it ACV. And so I wanted to actually show you how to put a uh, apple cider vinegar rinse um, together so that you can use it. Um, this, this rinse is excellent for um, pre-poo, pre-shampooing your hair. And so what you would do, first I'm gonna give you the recipe, you would take two parts apple cider vinegar to one part water, and then you would uh, drip a few drops of your favorite essential oil, or and or your favorite fragrance oil. And so sometimes I use both. Um, I My recipe is two parts apple cider vinegar, one part water, and um, a few drops of um, tea tree oil, which is good. I happen to use the Melaleuca brand. Uh, this is the wellness company, it's a private company. And um, their products are excellent. And if you are interested, in their products, please get in touch with me. I'll leave my contact information down in the description box. You have to be a member to get the 30 to 40% discount. So anyway, um, I will definitely share that information if you'd like to do that. However, um, I use, um, like I said, two parts, um, uh, two parts apple cider vinegar to one part water and I uh, use a, maybe three uh, drops, three or four drops of the tea tree oil. And um, I usually either put clary sage or patchouli, patchouli uh, lavender or something. This, these are my essential oils that helps with um, the health of my scalp. And sometimes I'll even put some fragrance oil in there. This is Zen fragrance oil. And but you can use any fragrance oil that you'd like to just so that it won't have that uh, vinegar smell. <laughs> so I'm going to uh, show you exactly how um, show you what it looks like. And then I used a just a bottle, uh, a squeeze bottle. Any squeeze bottle is good. This is from Sally's Beauty Supply. And uh, as you can see, it has the measurements here. So for instance, if, I'm, if I use four ounces of apple cider vinegar, then I will use five, uh, um, I'm sorry, I will use one ounce of water in there. So like I said, it's two parts um, apple cider vinegar to one part water. So again, I will use four ounces of apple cider vinegar to um, one ounce of water. And then I would, uh, like I said, drip some tea tree oil and some fragrance oil. So I'm going to put this on pause and I'm going to come back to you once I have it all together so you can see how it looks. And so I ended up using five ounces of apple cider vinegar and, and two ounces of water. That's actually, I guess, the more correct uh, measurements. And though this is the tea tree oil and I'm just going to drop one, two, three, four, five, drops of that in there. And then I'm going to use the Clary Sage, which is excellent for um, your scalp as well. So this is one, two, three, four, five drops in there. Sometimes you can control the drops and sometimes you can't. So it doesn't really matter. And then I'm going to add some Zen fragrance oil, just so that it won't have that vinegary scent. And so I'm just going to just pour a little bit of that in there just to make it smell better. And then what I do is just take, put the top on here and I just kind of shake it up a little bit like so. And let me see how it smells. Mm, it smells 
much better than just playing vinegar on your head. Smells good, actually. And so <clears throat> I just, you know, shake it up. And just, just before I shampoo, I dot the uh, this concoction all through my hair, this whole bottle. I just let it uh, hang over the sink or the tub and just uh, let it saturate my hair real good. And then I'll massage my scalp. Oh, massage all of that um, mixture into my scalp. And then I put on a plastic cap. Hold on. <laughs> so I put on a plastic cap like so, just a regular plastic cap. And I put all my hair into the plastic cap with the rinse on my scalp. And sometimes if your hair is real long, you can you know, actually put it up in a big braid and tuck it under. And on top of this, I'll either put my super, my jumbo super, um, super absorbent towel cap on, like so. And what this do is it, as you can see, the thick band around here, the thick band, it catches all the water from dripping down your neck and wetting up your clothes and the floor and all of that. So I have my towel, my um, plastic cap. Then I put the towel cap on here. This is the jumbo uh, towel cap. And then this is the regular super absorbent towel cap. So either one is good. And um, I'm, I go about my business. I do my housework. And I just sit around for about an hour. I let it sit on there for about an hour. <clears throat> and then after an hour, my scalp feels good. I don't feel that itchy dryness anymore. And then I take off the, 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 the plastic and the cap and everything. And then I will shampoo my hair with my either pure and gentle deep cleansing shampoo or the Argan uh, Oil Luxurious uh, Moisturizing Shampoo, which, where do I have it? Hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on. Oh my goodness, I don't even have, I'll show you, okay. Well, that's the spray. But anyway, I will show you how the shampoo I'll, I'll probably flash a picture, but anyway, I'll have the links to the, to the products on the description below. So then I'll shampoo my hair with my shampoo. Either one is great. The peppermint or the argan or the, you know, the uh, pure and gentle is great. After that, I rinse my hair real thoroughly. And the way you, I think I'll link uh, uh, the video that I made on how to properly shampoo your hair thoroughly so that you can see that you the 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 deal with that is that you need to move your hair around and expose your scalp so that you can get all the residue off of your scalp that contributes as well to itching and dryness so anyway i do that and then afterwards i let it air dry and or i put my uh conditioner on there either conditioner is fine the super uh, conditioning whipped cream is excellent. You can leave that in. It has jojoba and lanolin. I'll have that link in the description box. Um, also, the um, argan oil, the super moisturizing argan oil uh, conditioner, you can leave that in and or the peppermint, the cool tingling peppermint uh, conditioner, you can leave that in and or rinse that out. So that is my tip for today to uh, do a ACV uh, apple cider vinegar rinse and just massage your scalp. Let it sit into your, your hair for about an hour on your scalp. And that I'm telling you, your scalp will feel so refreshed and then rinse it out well and shampoo and condition and shake and go. And so that is my tip for today. ACV to eliminate and combat dryness of scalp and hair. So until tomorrow, I'll see you soon.